click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hi guys, in this particular video, we will learn the numerical number 3 that is on DC analysis of FET. This kind of numerical is based on voltage divider bias. So, so much mathematics involved in it. Let's see how it works. In this circuit, we have two resistances at gate side. One is of 82 mega ohm and one is of 11 mega ohm. Three capacitors are connected. One is CC1, CC2, two coupling capacitors. CE is a bypass capacitor. I can give the Namakaran as CS as well, which is more appropriate for FET. I have named it as CE, but it does not make any sense for DC analysis at least. So 2K is your drain resistance. 610 ohm is your source resistance. 20 volts is applied external potential at drain side. Given values 12 milliampere IDSS and VP is equal to minus 3 volts and you have to find out your favorite findings that is VDSQ and IDQ. VS and VD are more additional findings that we have to see how to find. Step number one that is here in this circuit capacitors are involved right so we have to open all the capacitors so that input and output should not have to deal with your dc analysis circuit right so we have to deal with only dc supply voltage to calculate the q point we'll redraw this circuit जैसे ये कैपेसिटर्स निकल जाते हैं, we feel that circuit is more and more simple, right? This is a very simple circuit now. We have just have to modify using Thevenin's equivalent circuit. What will be the value of VTH? VTH is equal to 11 mega divided by 11 mega plus 82 mega multiplied by 20 calculate that value come on quick value of vth is 2.366 volts calculate the value of rth rth is 82 simple 9.7 mega ohm that is the value of rth let's modify this circuit by using thevenin's equivalent model This is again simple circuit, right? Then we can apply your input KVL. You can use Shockey's equation. We'll get the quadratic equation. And then we can find out the value of ID and VGS. This is your input KVL. Start from VTH. So here you will be getting the value of VGS something different in two terms. One is with VTH and another is with IG because IG as it is neglected. So there is no meaning to have your value of RTH whether it is correct or not. VGS is equal to VTH minus 610 multiplied by ID. 
I will write this as 2.366 because the value of VTH is 2.366 minus 0.6 into ID. Okay, equation number one. This will make complex, right? From equation of ID, ID is equal to ID SS multiplied by 1 minus VGS divided by VP the whole square. What is VGS? This is the VGS that will increase your mathematical work. Let's do like kids put no equation 1 into now your value of ID is equal to IDSS which is given 12 milli will keep a large bracket 1 minus put the value of VGS that is 2.366 minus I will write it over here 0.61 K multiplied by I D right here I forgot to mention the value K divide by minus minus 3 square this milli will come out here and form K you will be getting 5.366 minus 0.61k into id the whole square now solve to get quadratic equation pause your screen start your work and honestly reach to the final equation that is quadratic equation This is the quadratic equation 0 0.372 mega id square minus 7.3 kilo id plus 28.79 is equal to 0. Solve this quadratic equation to get id 1 and id 2. Id 1 we are getting 14.15 milli ampere and id 2 and second root that is 5.46 milli. 5.46 four six seven milli ampere now you start thinking that whether we have to select id1 or id2 which value is less than idss that is 12 milli ampere obviously this one so we will select this one we will reject this one as should be less than id SS. right so what do we want we want idq and that idq itself is an id that is id1 which is equal to 5.467 milli ampere right they have not asked us to find the value of vgsq right so gada work nahi karne ka we will directly find out the value of VDS, right? So to find out the value of VDS, we will apply KVL to output. Simple, here it is of 2K. This is plus 20. And this is the value of VDSQ that is expected. 20 minus I'll write directly ID into 2k plus 0.61k because as it is in source and drain same current will flow minus VDSQ here I'll mention IDQ will incorporate this particular value so VDSQ 20 minus 
5.467 milli multiplied by 2k plus that is nothing but 2.61 k k ne milli ko mar diya 14.27 20 minus 14.27 that is nothing but 5.73 this is the value that is second value right next is they ask us to find the value of vs and vd right can we find out the value of vs and vd yes we can easily find out the value of vs as vs is equal to id multiplied by 610 see this circuit vs is here right so this vs is nothing but with respect to ground right so i can say that with respect to ground agar main chahta hu to that is nothing but the voltage across this resistance 610 but if we apply same logic that will not be applicable vd is not the voltage across 2k ohm right yahi mistake bar bar exam mein hoti hai bahut logon ke sath 2k ke across jo kuch voltage aata hai that is not vd rather 20 minus 2k ke across jo kuch voltage aata hai that is your value of vd right so we will find out the value of vs first we'll make the use of vds to find out the value of vd so that will become very very simple i know the value of id that is this one so we'll incorporate that value i'll make use of kilo that is 0.61 kilo and again kilo ne milli ko mar diya we will be getting the value 4.5.467 multiplied by 0.61 find out that value vs becomes 3.33 so this is another finding for third parameter now apply your logic apply your brain vds is nothing but vd minus vs we know the value of vds we know the value of vs can we find out the value of vd as it is by using these two equations yes as i said vds is equal to vd minus vs so you can say that vd is equal to vds plus vs add these two it will become 9.06 So we have got all the answers that they were expecting in a very smooth manner. I hope you have learned a lot from this particular video. In next upcoming videos, we will combine the BJT and FET and in that particular circuit, we'll find out so many findings very easily. Thank you. To learn more and more EDC, you have to subscribe the Ikeda channel. Thank you so much.